Hi everybody! So I wanted to jump on and show you my really quick morning skincare routine. And I know sometimes a lot of people will look at like what I use on my skin and they're like, oh my god, there's so many steps to it. Honestly, it's so simple. It's under five minutes to do. Your skin is protected. Your skin is getting all the nutrients it needs. So um, follow along as I do this video. But first thing I wanted to kind of show you, I do double cleanse morning and night. And what I find that's easier is I actually will double cleanse in the shower. So I use the um, Beauty Counter Counter Time Cleansing Oil. I put this, so while the shower is warming up, what I'll do is pump two pumps into my hands. While my skin is still dry, I'm gonna manipulate it into my skin. So it's kind of like a nice massage into the face, which is really cool. And then when I get in the shower, I take a little bit of water onto my hands and I'm gonna emulsify that oil. So I'm gonna make it look milky and soapy. What that's doing is it's helping to grab all the dirt, the leftover makeup, all that fun stuff. It's helping to grab all of that and remove it so that you have clean skin to put all your great products on. I use a lot of different products. In my spa, I carry specific products that I really love and I've used and no noticed a difference in my skin. Because I'm a, a Clean Beauty ambassador, I um, am part of the Clean Beauty kit and so I get to test out different products that are coming. And so two of the products that you're gonna see are the Orpheus. I really love these. These came out, this one came out in the August box and this one came out in the September box. So it's a toner and a serum, or it's called an essence, so you could use it like a toner, you spritz it all over. Everything I do, you're gonna notice, I bring it down onto my chest. So typically I'm naked while I'm doing this. And I, and that's why I love to cleanse in the shower because I take it onto my decollete, my neck, and my face. So let's get started here. I'm gonna start washing my face with the charcoal bar. So as you heard in the beginning, I do do my first cleanse in the shower with the oil cleanser. And I typically do this in the shower as well, but I wanted to show you guys how I use the charcoal bar. To dry off my face, I like to use these makeup cloths I got from the company Makeup Eraser. You can find them on Etsy too, but basically these are really nice microfiber cloths. One side is said to exfoliate a little bit, um, but it's not like a grainy exfoliation, it's really soft. The other one is just to help wipe away any leftover residue of the cleanser or makeup. What's really nice about these two is if you wet them, it'll help to remove any makeup before you go in and cleanse. Don't mind me here as I adjust my camera, I wanted to make sure you guys saw everything. So now I'm going to spritz the Resurrection Essence from Orpheus, and this is a really nice, you can use as a toner. It's going to hydrate and leave the skin nice and glowy. Uh, it's got a great hydrating product in it. And there's also the Orpheus Resurrection Serum, which I like to use. One pump is plenty. This is a great product. You're going to use it on your face, neck, and decollete. Press it into your skin first, and then go in and massage it. These two products I actually got in the Clean Beauty Kit. Um, if that's something you're interested in, go to cleanbeautykit.com. And if you decide to sign up for a box, make sure you enter my name, Lisette Weevil, at checkout, and they will give you a free goodie in your box. So now I'm gonna do a little hydration with the Beauty Counter uh, Counter Time Moisturizer. So this one's really lightweight. I use just a tiny bit because I'm gonna go in with an SPF moisturizer as well. But what I love about this moisturizer is it has a, an ingredient called Bakuchiol in it. I am allergic to retinol, so Bakuchiol is an alternative to retinol that is more gentle, gives you the same benefits without any of the side effects of it. So the last step to my morning ritual is SPF. Now this is a product that I got from PCA Skin. It's really great because it's a tinted eye cream that has an SPF 15 in it. So it's protecting the skin, which is super delicate underneath your eyes, while also kind of evening out your skin tone. And then I'm gonna go in with the Cary Gran sunscreen. I love this stuff. It seems like it's an oil-based um, SPF. This one is specifically is a tinted SPF, so 
the previous one I used to use, her original, had left like a white cast on darker skin tone. I loved it. It just took a minute for the sunscreen to settle in. But she came out with several colors of these to really help somebody with darker skin tones and even lighter skin complexions get more of an even coverage with the SPF protection. This is my absolute hands down favorite SPF for the face. It gives you a nice dewy finish. It smells nice and earthy. I really love the natural scent and it really protects. This is a great one and I highly recommend you try this. So my final touches for the whole skin ritual is I like to go in with a happiness oil. And this one I put in the inner crevices of where my elbows are. I put them onto my wrist and into the backs of my ears, typically where you would put like a fragrance oil. The smell is delicious and it just kind of lasts throughout the day and kind of brings like a happy energy to me. I like to touch up my lips with the Mona Moon Lip Balm. It's my absolute favorite lip balm. I swear by this stuff. Mona Moon has some great products. So I like to put that, these lips nice and soft. And then I finish off with a cuticle oil. I do this every single morning and it's less than five minutes, you guys, for all of this. This is not only taking care of my skin for my face, but I'm also taking care of my entire body. At night, I like to take my time washing my face. I give myself massages. I go in with my gua sha tool. Um, but in the morning, it tends to be a little bit faster, usually because I'm like heading out and I'm running behind. <laughs> so I have to do a quick, and I've got the kids, so you have to do a quick get ready. So all of this under five minutes, so easy. If you have any questions, let me know, reach out to me, and I will see you guys in the next video.